Of course, you might be thinking at home, you know, what would you put in your car if you had to evacuate? It's not a normal thing to think about. What's the most important stuff you have and how much can you can fit in the, in the back seat and trunk of your vehicle? But it's something a lot of people need to start thinking about and already have. Trying to remember everything during a high stress evacuation is such a big thing to ask. So here is what the website ready.gov recommends. Water, first and foremost. They recommend a gallon per person per day and to plan for at least three days. Also, a three-day supply of non-perishable food, a battery-powered radio, a flashlight, first aid kit, some extra batteries, a dust mask, right, because of all of the everything in the air, all the smoke right now, garbage bags, phone chargers, and physical maps, just in case you don't have phone service. So remember that, too. Also, keep an eye on how much gas you have in your car. Consider backing up important files you might have, and it's important to have these things ready to go. Keep it somewhere that you can easily grab it and go if you have to leave in a hurry because we know how fast these fires can move.